There's a basket for Smaragda in the warehouse. She's waiting. What does it mean to be truly righteous? To never succumb to temptation, or to take a vow of chastity despite constant temptation? Our heroine did not know the answer to this question, and preferred never to dwell on it. If it were up to her, she would have chosen the quiet life of a nun. However, destiny had something different in store for her. can help. You're the last person I need right now. Get lost. Sorry. For the sake of the prayers of all the... Stesha, do you have something prepared for Smaragda? It's cold today, isn't it? <laughs> oh, potatoes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. The sisters laughed, Indica. 
Christian love is known to be patient, merciful, and faithful. However, in a lowly human sense, they didn't love her that much. To be completely honest, they didn't love her at all. Many of them felt nothing but disgust for her. Indica, however, was not to blame. Were it not for the voice that was inculcating ideas in her, unforgivable for a Christian, she would have been a virtuous and rather mediocre nun. Indica's biggest dream was for that voice to leave her alone once and for all. Her entire life became a struggle, a painful resistance. No matter how hard she tried, no matter how much she tortured herself, the voice grew louder and more convincing every day. Bring some water.
Useless labor is the basis of spiritual development. Obedience is above fasting or prayers. Indica didn't understand why she needed to retrieve the water from the well if there was a pump next door that took it from a sacred spring. She didn't understand why drinking from the spring was allowed, but cooking soup was a sin. The well was only about 15 meters away from the spring. It was not possible to have any other water there. Even a tenth of it is the same. They say, on Epiphany, even a drop of holy water blesses an entire canister. If that were true, a couple of evaporated drops from the spring would bless the puddles beneath her. We haven't eaten even ten of them. With God's help, we'll make it to spring. 
No way. Sisters won't eat after her. Mother, the sign of the cross saves from the plague. But this, God forgive me. Glory to Smaragda, don't tempt me. I'm sending Evdakia to you. Don't let this one into the refectory. As an outlaw shall I confess thee. Remember me, O Lord, in thy kingdom. May my communion of thy immaculate mysteries, O Lord, not be judged or condemned, but heal the body and soul. It is forbidden to leave the convent without a blessing. Despite her requests, Indica had not been blessed to leave for a full year. When she was tasked with delivering the letter, it took her completely by surprise. Even though she did not know the contents of that letter, she could not shake the feeling that it would play an extremely important, perhaps critical, role in her life. in it.
For the sake of the prayers of all the saints, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us. Tisha, I need to go to the other side. Georgie, pirate, be quiet. The animals feel the unholiness. They're just happy to see me. Tisha, I'm sorry. The animals feel the unholiness. I brought you some apples. Or lovka, your favorite. Tisha, I must hurry to the train. fall again. Don't worry, Tichon, I understand. Forgive me, for Christ's sake. Indica loved Tihon. Imbecile was a medical diagnosis, so she was just using the word literally. In any case, Tihon couldn't hear her. Hypocrisy isn't really a virtue, is it? It was as if the convent didn't want to let her go. Even though she knew there was no place closer to God, she yearned to leave it, at least for a short time. Not true! As I thought thou dost raise up the paralytic, O Lord God, by thy godlike care and might, raise up my soul, which is palsied by diverse sins and transgressions, and by unsinly deeds and acts, that saved I may cry out, Glory to thy power, O compassion of Christ. Like the man who fell among thieves and was wounded, so... Always a dent. Because of thy boundless mercy and compassion, I dare to approach thee, O Christ. Prayers that were repeated so much they lost their original meaning. Hated to smile at Sister Martha's toothless jokes. Hated... Find this barren of good deeds, but I beseech thee, O Lord, pour out upon me a drop of thy mercy and cleanse me, for I am def- Signing the cross over her mouth after every yawn, before entering the temple, after crying, after leaving the temple, after entering the refectory, praying before entering her cell, before going- Thus, wisdom, hast her compassion on our souls, so in these latter days hast thou made us anew by thy bloodshedding. 
because of thy boundless mercy and compassion, I dare to approach thee, O Christ. Receive me as thou didst the public and the prodigal in the heart. Praise of the saints, apologizing, repenting, praying, apologizing, endless oaths, the black veils, apologizing. Grace, for who can tell of thy mighty works, O Christ, or who can number them? Hated Smaragda's tasteless cabbage soup, the smell of rotting old women that even insects could not cover. I have fallen among thieves and was wounded, so have I also fallen through my sins and my sickness wound. Oh, she didn't go out of her way to use that skill. Just like her personal hygiene, always at lunch, she would carefully clean the devil's work from her dentures with her finger. Indica hated endless prayers that were repeated so much they lost their original meaning. Hated to smile at Sister Martha's toothless jokes. Hated the few... Jesus Christ, what, what, what are you doing here? You. The cloisters is here! Huh. What, what, what nun is you? fine. The conventual is here! The nun. But, listen, you're, you're lucky to b bump into me. I, I, I keep missing and I'm, I'm no g good at this. Just, what? Go, 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 go. Get out of here. What? What? I, who's there? to bump into him. He's... Not a great shot. Yes! Sorry, I can help if you let me. No, I don't think it can be helped. His nobleness has decided to listen to the visitation one last time. So let him listen. Don't interrupt. Excuse me, what, what happened here? Have you heard the joke about a crowbar in a train toilet? So, there was this train with a bunch of convicts. They put a spring between two carriages while the train was moving. They tried to plan an escape, I guess. How many died? Mostly fugitives. Many of them were shot. Have had to care for the sick. Of course, we often have to. Then come with us to the station. All the wounded are there.
He says the wounded are waiting at the station and then injects a corpse with morphine. Maybe out of respect for his dying wish, or for the size of his epaulets. What do you think? Stop! Lost your nerve, huh? Why do you stop me? Since when do you obey me? Don't worry. Fear is a natural reaction, life-saving in most cases. What is your goal? To help the girl or show what a hero you are? To Exactly. If you're trying to help, there's no chance. Listen to her. Doesn't like getting abandoned in the middle of an act. What? What? Did you see the size of that thing? Maybe you wanted to join them. <laughs> Not bad, I... <laughs> didn't have enough, you motherfucker.
hold on. Wait! Quiet. Stop yelling. You've saved me, and I, I, I've i saved someone too. Poor girl, a little more, and she could have... Oh, Lord have mercy on for us. And you didn't see. She got away. Well, well, I, did, I didn't... I don't know how much, but if it weren't for me... God deliver us sinners from... Sorry, w what is your name? Ilya. Indica. You know, they say that every hour that a patient doesn't get medical attention, their chance of survival is halved. Crazy thing to say, to be honest. It makes no sense to generalize like that. Do we include every case, even a pricked finger? Of course... No idea where to take it or where it came from. Sister! Did you arrive safely? No incidents? Kasyuk, is that you? Wait a second! <laughs> oh! Hey, you drop your weapon. D drop it. You drop your your weapon. No, no. <laughs> throw, throw your rifle here. Don't turn your don't turn your conscience with sin. You're going nowhere, mate. All right. N -n -n Manage. Manage. I've got nothing to lose. <laughs> Fine, just... Well, don't shoot, all right? Do it like this. Get on. Get on him. I'm telling you, go. Go. Get, get on. Going. Going! I'm telling you! I won't find you, huh? Come on in!
Hey. Hey. Are you wounded? so much sorry we're doing no more than five verse an hour though whoa, whoa, whoa. how do you understand it huh is he talking about the word versed or how to start an engine I grew up in a bike shop my father sold them and in Spasov why in Spasov no in Godadishi I've never been to Spasov that's where I grew up <laughs> the man's logic is flawless. Uh, are you embarrassed to be so close to a man? She's been waiting for that. He's quite a looker, huh? Thick boy. Uh, I must smell awful. No, they, they kept us in the train for three days. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> she likes it. Whoa! Come on, come on! Grab her tits! Hey! Stop pretending! She's just like the men you imagine in your room when you're... Enough! All right, calm down. But is he a bandit or a sissy? Hold on to your seat, for God's sake!
Are you all right? I'm sorry, can I take a look, please? Oh, there's nothing to look at. Better give me an injection. Oh my god. I'm afraid this will happen. If we don't amputate it, you won't survive the afternoon. Our prison doctor, he told me the same thing. Word for word. But that was over a week ago. And he didn't do anything? Sadly, the only surgical equipment he had was a, was a rusty wash basin. Very funny. All right. All right. Don't, don't worry. It should be like that. Only like that. I'm, I'm also talking to God. To God? Great. You need to get up if you don't want to lose something else to frostbite. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Okay. What do you mean you talk to God? What? Oh, my arm. You've seen my arm, yes? It's been a week, or more. I doubt it. And what does God have to do with this? Well, uh, let me explain. Ever since that night, everything, every event, it all happened as I was told it would. I I'm certain I was the only one who left that train alive. It's all going according to plan. Every fucking step is God's plan, do you understand? So taking me hostage was God's plan? I know what you're thinking. But remember the Gospel. The father who gave his money to the prodigal son, not to the beloved one. The good one. But to the bandit. He who had been murdering and stealing, but came back. He came back. Do you understand? I think the Lord is happier to see to see one repentant sinner than well, a hundred thousand righteous people. I don't know. I, they don't even need repentance. Do, do, do you hear me? You know, he, he laid everything out before me. Spread out like a deck of cards. The past, the present, the future. Who? God, who else? I was lying there, about to die. And a sister, just like you, brought me some water in this mug. And I was drinking and I saw... I saw ripples in the water, little round waves, and heard a whisper, so I drank, and... You heard God in a cup? In a cup, yes. But that's, that's not the point. I'll show you when we get there. Maybe we should go around. A nun and an officer? Who cares? But the telegraph poles. The cables are ripped out, though. And the road. Doesn't look like it's been used lately. the fuck would do this? It's as if they blocked the passage on purpose. The brake is rusted shut. I have to find something to get rid of the screw. It won't fucking budge. Maybe there's something in that shed.
So? Not yet. I've missed this smell. So? Found a wrench. Give it to me. Dog, calm down. I hate them. Hurry up. Quiet, quiet, little doggy. We won't hurt you. Are you crazy? Run. No, I, I would have already fucked you up with my bare hands if I wanted. Well, oh, hand. Why? I mean, why the fuck did you throw away the revolver? Oh, it would have been useful. I mean, a girl. Oh, I, would, I would never. Tell me something. If you're God's chosen one, why didn't God heal you completely right away? That's a good question. 
Here's your answer. Here. Here. The cadets. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Come on. I don't understand. So God had enough power only to stop the rotting, but to heal you completely, he needed some kind of tool. It's not, it's, it's not about the tool. A man can't be saved against his will, you see. Basically, look, yeah, it has nothing to do with my arm. It's about the path, the path we've been given. And whether to follow it or not, it's up to us. What do I have to do with it? So, possessed people are taken to the Kadyats? Everybody is. Do I look possessed to you? No, n not you. All right, let's get out of here. Hoist me up. Me hoist you up? Yes, you. You won't be able to pull me up from up there. Shit. Ilya? Go. Are you alive? Ilya? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on? Ugh. <sighs>